Good morning, Entertainment City. I'm Jeremy John. Today we've got the Barbara, Barbara Walters list of the most fascinating people of the year, and the top pick might actually very surprise you. Uh, plus, the latest in the Sony hacking scandal. This time, they're actually releasing something we want to know about. But we're going to start with Bill Cosby. He's breaking a silence about the recent allegations. The interview with Page Six was very brief, but Cosby did make a couple of pointed remarks. One, that portions of the media are to blame. Cosby is quoted as saying, I only expect the black media to uphold the standards of excellence in journalism. And when you do that, you have to go in with a neutral mind. The former sitcom actor was also asked about his wife's reaction to the growing list of accusers. Cosby said she is dealing with it with, quote, love and strength of womanhood. The former Hollywood giant is facing accusations from over 20 women who say they were assaulted by Cosby. The latest is former model Beverly Johnson, who claims she was drugged by Cosby but was able to escape before being assaulted. Cosby continues to deny all the recent allegations, and his lawyer has called them unsubstantiated, fantastical stories. Next up, the Sony Pictures leak. Mostly to this point, it's been two-faced Hollywood execs saying mean things about the stars. But now we've got something worth reading, the next James Bond script. Everybody needs a hobby. So what's yours? Resurrection. It turns out that an early draft for the next James Bond film may have been leaked online. Now we know the film is going to be called Spectre and it's due out in November of next year, but the producers have promised some pretty big surprises in this film, so it's understandable that they don't want anyone to ruin the fun. Now MGM is reminding everyone that any copy of the script is property of the company, so consider yourself warned. Spectre will star Christoph Waltz, Ray Fiennes, and of course, Daniel Craig as James Bond. And finally, Barbara Walters came out with her list of the most fascinating people of the year. And the number one might surprise you. The most fascinating person of the year? Amal Clooney. Yeah, George Clooney's wife. She beat out some big name people like Taylor Swift, Michael Strahan, Oprah Winfrey, George R.R. Martin, Neil Patrick Harris, and Scarlett Johansson. So why Mrs. Clooney? Was it because of her strong record as a human rights lawyer? No, no, just because she married Clooney. The surprisingly shallow Walters called it the wedding of the year. She complimented Amal's fashion and said that everyone likes Amal and George because it's, quote, impossible to resist perfection. Now, she may be actually perfect because Amal Clooney refused to be interviewed for the Barbara Walters special. Walters hinted that this could be the last of her annual specials that's been running since 1993. That's a first look at your entertainment city on this Monday morning. Catch the second edition coming up just after 8. And be sure to follow the latest celebrity buzz on Twitter. You can tweet us at NCity.